But first, the man accused of killing one man and hurting 14 others in a mass shooting on 6th Street last year was in court today. DeAndre White, his defense attorney and a representative for the state, spent only a few minutes in front of the judge. The state wants to expedite the case, saying it feels the investigation is complete. The judge scheduled the next hearing for White in eight weeks. According to court records, back in June, White and a group of friends encountered a rival group of men they knew from Colleen on 6th Street. It goes on to say when someone from that group showed a gun, White pulled his handgun and fired multiple rounds into crowds of people. The shooting killed 25-year-old Douglas Cantor, who was visiting Austin from Michigan. KXAN investigator Dalton Huey had a chance to sit down with Cantor's family before today's hearing. Dalton, we cannot imagine this family's pain, but what did they say as we're nearing a closure here for the trial? Britt, the Cantor family is, is devastated. Um, you know, as you said before, Douglas was visiting from Michigan. He was celebrating just recently receiving his master's degree. Um, you know, his family talked a lot about his kindness and how excited he was to come to Austin, um, you know, a place he called beautiful. Um, now they want to see justice for Douglas and hopefully spark changes in the city. I want this to be the landmark that turns this city from where it is now to where it was when my brother was on the computer researching it. I want the city to turn back and remember what happened to my brother and say this is never going to happen again. What happened to my son, it hurts. It'll never go away. KXAN investigator Dalton Huey, thank you so much and thank you for sharing those family members' words. Later tonight on KXAN News at 6, KXAN's Brianna Hollis will take us down a timeline of what happened since that shooting on 6th Street to ensure that it is safer.